welcome back nail queens in today's video i'm going to show you how i remove my press on nails in just like five minutes using a press off removal serum so i haven't spoken about this yet on my channel but i did come out with this press off removal serum because i get tired of soaking in acetone or soapy water so here are the ingredients in case you're allergic to anything and come follow along the first thing you're going to need is an orange wood stick. I highly recommend this over any kind of cuticle pusher. It's definitely more gentle. So the first thing that I do is I take the slanted end of the cuticle stick and I run it around the cuticle and side walls of each of my press on nails just to create like kind of a little lifted edge. Like it doesn't have to be super big and super lifted. I just want a little cavity underneath my press on nails so that when I apply the press off removal serum it can seep underneath the press on and come in contact with the glue that's the most important part of why I'm doing this process of course if your press ons are already lifting pretty well you might be able to skip this step but of course I personally prefer to help along with the lifted edges now I take the press off remover and I use the dropper bottle and I put a few drops of the serum around the cuticle and sidewall edges and I do it for each of the nails. There's several ways you can do it. You can just drop it on the nail or you can stick the smallest amount of the cuticle pusher underneath the nail and then help the remover just seep in there even better. Uh, it's really up to you. I sent this to one of my ambassadors and she did it this way where I'm sticking the cuticle stick under here. So I was like, oh, that's genius. Just that, like, that's so smart. It probably helps it a lot better. And then I put a few more drops under where the free edge is just because the glue holds on there more than any other part of the nail and I don't know why. Now my thumbnail is the most stubborn nail of all and it is the most difficult for me to get off regardless if I'm soaking in acetone, warm soapy water, or using the press off remover. But I do find that the press off remover helps this process along a lot faster than if I were using the other two methods. Now I let the press off remover sit on my nails for two to four minutes. You can go even longer if you want to. And after a few minutes, I take that same slanted edge and I just wedge it underneath the press on nail and I'm making sure to not apply force. Like you wanna be very, very gentle because if you are too forceful about this, you can cause harm. Like it's just like sticking any other tool underneath your press on nails. It's not comfortable. So you want to make sure that you are of the most comfort the whole time when you're doing this. If you feel any discomfort, stop lodging the uh, cuticle stick underneath there. Add a couple more drops of the press off remover serum and then let it sit for a few more minutes. Do not force it. Whatever you do, the remover will do its magic in due time. I find that this process takes me usually about five minutes each hand. But of course, if you're using like thicker glues, like the Dashing Diva Fast Bond or IBD's like thick air dry glue, like they have a very thick one, the thicker consistency glues tend to be more difficult to remove with anything, whether it's um, soapy water, acetone, or even the press off remover. I've been able to successfully remove the Dashing Diva Fast Bond with the press off remover, but it took me nearly 30 minutes to do that. So I just wanna put that out there as like a disclaimer. If you're a Dashing Diva Fast Bond user, you most likely, unless you have like oily nails, you most likely won't be able to get them off in five minutes like I do here. The glue that I'm using, I've used a few here. I've used um, one that a friend sent me. I've used the McCart tube glue. I've used some brush on glues. I've been trying all different glues to see what the press off remover actually does work on. And I've had lots of success with the ones I just mentioned. And even my ambassadors have told me they had great success too with the ones they've used. So here you can see how it all came off. That is this magical serum right here. I highly recommend it if you use a very thin air dry glue to apply your press ons and you want them to come off easily. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. I'd love to hear them and I will see you in the next video. Bye. And you took my hand said let's leave now. Don't wanna be shy.